Alright you guys, so first, uh, this is my daughter's picture image that she's going to use. And then I wanted to show you my picture image that I'm going to use. As you can see, they are two totally different sizes. So there isn't really a set size that you have to use. You just have to make sure that it fits into your um, frame. And the frame that we're, we're going to be using, I believe it is um, a, a 8 by 10 I believe it's an 8 by 10 We picked it up from the Dollar Tree. Um, so my image is 6.8 in width by four inches in height and hers is okay and hers is five by five inches so that's what we're going to do right there and then this right here is my daughter's qr code um for her song you guys know because of like you know copyrights and all that um yeah i can't really get up into that but i will um give the website that i generated the qr code from in the description box so where you can get your qr code from will be in the description box um i did mine by the the web address the url all you do is simply uh paste it in, into this um box right here and then you go to download and there you go so I am now going to print off our images on some sticker paper. That way we don't have to use any type of glue or anything like that. We are going to uh, lay this down uh, using sticker paper. So stay tuned. All right, so these are our images all printed out. And um, my daughter wanted to go ahead and gloss hers up so i'm going to put a coat of the dimensional magic over it just to um just to gloss them up and shine them up i was going to do uh i was going to laminate them because you know that would really get them popping but then if i laminate it guess what it's no longer it's no longer a sticker so i'm just going to go ahead and throw one layer of gloss over it and call it a day Alright you guys, so I'm on here to show you guys how I'm going to create this, I don't even know if this is, song, play bar, media bar, I don't, I don't know what it's called. But I have buttons over here if I have to actually create this myself. Now, for those that have the silhouette or the cry cut, you can use that to cut out these images for you. You could also draw these images right onto the, the glass. Um, me, myself, I'm going to just print them out on a teal colored uh, cardstock paper because that matches my living room. So that's how I'm going to do it. But I just want to have it where it is just like no background. Like I just want the buttons. So for right now, I may just have to create this myself. I mean, it's not hard. That may just have to be something that I do. Okay, so we have this. Now let's see if I can um, take that background color out. So let's see if the background color is gone. Okay, yes, the background. Okay, you guys, I did it. The background color is gone. It is transparent. So now I'm just going to use this picture right here so that I can see how big it's going to be. Um, let me stretch it out just a little bit more. Okay, that actually looks, that looks good to me. And then I am going to, of course, I'm going to need, this is just an example so that I can see what it's supposed to look like. So I'm going to put my, uh, you know, rewind, fast forward, and I'm not going to put a pause button, but I'm going to put the play button there. So I'm going to use these, but I think these have a watermark on it, but that's fine. Because I'm going to crop all of that out. Anyway, I don't need those up there. The ones I need are right here. And if you are on my Patreon page, I will upload all these images. These right here is all that I need. And, like I said, I need to have a transparent background. So let's go back over here. Bam, background is gone, y'all. Background is gone. Of course, this is way, 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 way too big. So let's shrink this down some. It's 
about right here but I want to get it centered with this play button there we go so that is now centered with the play button I mean with the the bar I'm going to just put this one over that button send it forward I need it to be just a little bit bigger so that it fits over there perfect and of course you can see this uh, peeking through in the back so what I'm going to do is I'm going to insert just a little circle I'm going to color that white no outline I'm going to send that back Bam. I'm going to click and I'm going to group it together to where now it is one picture. Now the only thing that bothers me now is that the play button is a little bit darker than these other buttons. So I'm going to click on that and I'm going to go to format, corrections, bam. Now it's all blended together. It is matching. So before I am all the way done, I'm going to go ahead and insert two more of those smaller circles but I want them to now go over I want them to now go over the fast forward and rewind button I want them to go over this these buttons send backwards okay and then I'm going to group it wait not with that all right let's send it back okay and then I need to group it with this so group and then insert another one y'all it's starting to rain I know y'all that y'all like what ain't nobody doing all this okay send backwards send back okay now let's click it all together click and now I want to include the play button group now before I do this bar, I want this bar to be a uh, darker black as well. So let's fix that. Bam! Oh, that looks so crispy. Okay. And now I'm going to group them all together. Ooh, that looks nice. Ooh, that looks so nice. Okay. And now uh, I can go ahead and get rid of this because I don't even need that no more. Um, so let's insert the text. I don't even know what I'm going to call it, but for copyrights, I'm not going to put uh you know any of the artists um so just add that in there and then let's go ahead and move on all right you guys so this is my eight by ten photo frame that i got from the dollar tree i have my uh picture printed out as you can see it did give like a, a gloss a shine to it i have this printed out I have my QR code ready to go. So now the only thing I have to do is just put all of this stuff together. And you guys will see what I mean uh, when I was saying that you could just draw it on here. If you wanted to, you do not have to do this exactly like I am doing this. Because essentially all you really want... All you really want is this glass. This is the only thing that you want is the glass. And so this is what I was uh, talking about. If you're going to draw this on here, then you could just place the glass down on your little, you know, play button bar or whatever. And then just go ahead and draw it on there and trace, you know, from there. That's all you would have to do. Something simple, something so easy. Um, but like I said, I do, I want to hang this up. I want to be able to hang this up in my home. So I'm, I might, um, I'm going to leave mine in the frame because I'm going to hang mine up. So I'm going to go ahead, place my glass back in there. But as I said, uh, 
You can just straight put this on your glass. Of course, I'm going to turn this this way. And I'm going to have to cut this down, I see. So I'm going to go ahead and cut this down and then I'll be back. All right, you guys, so I am all finished. This is how mine turned out. My daughter did one as well. As y'all can see, her picture has a little glitter going off. I love how these came out. She put hers on the side. Love it. So now the moment of truth. Let's see if these things work. Let me see if I... Ow, that hurt. What is this? Oh, you got to go to the camera. Okay, so... Let's see if it works. Put it over there. And as you can see, it's going to an open YouTube link. We go there. Oh, my God. Why you got all this on your phone? What is wrong with y'all millennials? Please. Please stop. Okay. And as you can see, it went to the video. So, let's go ahead and let's test mine. Let's get off of that. Wait. No. Then we need to be on that. Where is your camera? Okay. So, let's now test mine let's see if mine work okay let's open in youtube all right y'all it worked we got it we got it popping off okay so if you have any questions at all please feel free to ask you guys i'm about to do a whole bunch of these things but you guys look at them they turned out super cute super cute super cute love them love them love them love them